everyone, welcome back. Today we're going by Grab from Bonondo here, Chinatown, the oldest in the world, to Quezon City, the biggest in Manila. <laughs> right, so we're going from Bonondo area. Somewhere up this road, past an amazing university through some hectic traffic, and then... All the way to the Blue Dot Trek. All the way up here to Quezon. Wow. Okay, here we go. Wow, this is seriously the back roads of uh, Bonondo. Did it say how long it would take us to get there? Huh? 36 minutes. Guys, hang in there. It's only going to be 36 minutes. Probably if we don't do traffic. Yeah. We never actually came down this far. No, no. Of construction going on. Oh, I'm just going to swing you guys out the side, and you can see some of the construction going on here. New buildings everywhere. I think we actually walked under that one to go see the noodles. Yeah, we did. That's side of it. Yeah. Oh, well. Back to out the front. Okay, back. We let, left the traffic behind us a bit. This is like a three lane road. They actually make them out of concrete. They don't melt in the sun. Yeah. <laughs> Ah, now we're stopping at the traffic light again. This here is actually the end of the train. The the light rail. So it might actually be coming all the way to, to Chinatown soon. Well, that's pretty cool. 7-Eleven? I'm not even going to point those out. There's so many of them. <laughs> Never seen so many 7-Elevens. No, it is. It is pretty cool. Oh, there we are. There's the 7-Eleven. Oh, this one looks like quite a big one. Vertical clearance, obviously, for the bridge. But there, it looks like that's as far as the train goes. There's a station up ahead. I'm still not sure what area we're in. That looks like Rizzle Avenue ahead. Uh, so if you guys know where Rizzle Avenue is, that's where we are now. I think there's a lot of those in the Philippines. <laughs> okay. So you guys still don't know where we are. <laughs> he was a hero. Right. <laughs> and going past a jeepney. Oh. And so much traffic. everything down here is this near that area that uh, I wouldn't know uh, Kaipo. yeah Kaipo. okay so this is near Kaipo it just suddenly seemed familiar mm -hmm. we have watched a lot of vlogs so we, we do sort of recognize but not really Okay guys, so around there is Kaipo Market somewhere there. I'm just going to go down and have a look up the side here. Go past all the jeepneys. And there we are. Wow. King Sisig. This looks like a mall almost. Yes, ma'am. Wow. Is it turned department store? Oh. And like a, an arch. Yeah. Oh, 
Helmet GP. Uh -huh. be across the road there access computer college another 7-eleven we're running with the metro yeah the metro is above us we'll be following it we will be passing through the oldest school here in the philippines the oldest school yeah it's built in 16 something 16 something, 16 something. the oldest Yo. school in the philippines from 1600 wow it's oh. pretty amazing, yeah. It's the University of Santa Tomas. Santa, ah, okay. It's Santa Tomas. It's built by yeah. the Spaniards wow. during the Spanish um, occupation here. Okay. Wow. But, sure, that is old because we saw the church and we thought 1590 was quite old, but university. yo, for university. We have nothing that old. Do we have anything that old? Um, the fort. Okay. It was from the Dutch. Yeah, Fort Frederick. Okay, I'll just put you guys on pause for a bit. Oh, look, there's a pizza hut. Really awesome there are loads of them, they're all San Juan. Oh, maybe that's the place they're going to. The Vasoria to San Juan. Yeah, that's the route. Okay, okay so that's the route on the side. Yeah, it's like a placard. Okay, like a signage. A signage, yeah. We'll have to figure those out at some point. Yeah, I don't know about stepping up the back of those. Yeah, Looks so quite steep. <laughs> just so many shops like everywhere there's shops under all these buildings yeah but there's so many people in the yeah pedestrian crossings work I don't know what there's more of Jollibees or 7-elevens <laughs> <laughs> GPT. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it only knows Intramuros, have you been there? Intramuros, no, we haven't. We, we were planning to go. If you're interested in history. Mm. Yes. Definitely. We have to wait until someone's leg is better. Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. we've got to walk a lot. <laughs> yeah, it's a lot of walking. I'm limping a little. be able to see it but um, at the university there's an arch that was erected in 1680. Wow. Looks amazing. We'll have to come visit sometime. Definitely. Have you searched it? No. Did you do some research quickly there, right? I just looked it up on Google, yes. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be passing by. Okay. After that street, that's the University of Santa Tomas. Okay. how the traffic lights have the number countdown for how long you have to get through it. Mm. Uh -huh. You have 50 seconds to get through otherwise you have to get stopped again. Okay so this over here 
across there is the oldest university. University of Saint Thomas. Yes, ma'am. Sixteen eleven. Oh, wow. Sixteen eleven. Wow, and it has an arch, which we have to find. <laughs> we will come back, guys. We will come uh, back. Explore yeah. UST. Yeah, UST. You can find the um, best structural building there inside. Okay, there's wow. The yeah, there's, oh, there's the arch. The arch. Uh, oh. You guys are going to have to wait. I will come back and show you the arch. So subscribe and, uh, you know, those things you do. Okay, I can see up ahead that the traffic light will be 83 seconds. So I'm going to put you guys on pause. Is that yet? <laughs> yeah. Oh, cool overwalk bridge. Is it still the university here? Yes, sir. So the university carries for a long time. We made it almost all the way to the traffic light. Now we got another 95 seconds to wait. <laughs> Welcome to the Philippines. <laughs> Back on. And we're off again. Oh, a McDonald's drive through. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully everyone's interested in watching us driving to Quezon City. Yeah. We find it fascinating. It's such a different type of road. And we're on the wrong side of the road. Yes, guys, this is the wrong side of the road. As you can see, <laughs> traffic coming from the wrong side. Because <laughs> we drive on the other side of the yeah, road. Yeah, we're used to going on that side. So it's a little bit hard for us. It feels like I should be driving. Yeah. I should have the steering wheel. <sighs> railroad crossing. Oh, they have the railroad here as well. Wow. Very, very big place. Yeah, it is massive. And it looks like they're building a new highway up there. Yep. Yeah, they can no longer build them at ground level, they have to put them above. Proper old school railroad crossing. Oh, I'm just gonna have a look down the side, see if we can see where the. No, no such luck, guys. Oh no, there we are. Proper railroad tracks. <laughs> oh. Maybe uh, back on. Now it's cool that some of the old buildings have been kept. Some from the 50s, 60s, 80s. Yeah, it's a real mix. Yeah, which is kind of cool. Yeah. So if you're looking for an architectural style, you actually be able to find one here. Metro oil. Also a lot of petrol stations we don't know anything about. Different brands. Unlimited barbecue. it goes all the way from one side to the other yes, looks like welcome to Quezon City it actually says it up there right next to the massive Jollibee Sun this is the boundary between Manila and 
Quezon City. Okay, so now we're actually leaving Manila and coming into Quezon City. Yes, sir. Oh. And we got lions at the gate here as well. King. Seems people do like really big cars. Yeah, like I mean some of those cars are massive. I suppose it's like jeepneys, you can put more people in them. <laughs> yeah. And this is like uh, midday, so we're traveling completely not in peak. Yeah, yeah, so it's like, wow. yeah, I'll probably be completely full. It's at about 12 o'clock at the moment. Yes. Oh, banana tree with bananas. Oh, just proof that we're in a tropical climate. There's a Chinese thing here. Oh. Spaces, you know. Lechon, Menok. Seven Eleven. It's been a while. Popeyes. No, it's just an advert for Popeyes. They got some other chicken thing here. Endox. Endox. Yeah, that's why I'm pointing out all the food things. Oh, we're about to go underground. That's a cool building. Okay, not quite underground, but going below deck level. Yeah, it's some cool uh, wall art.
Jollibee 24 hour. Oh, diggers. Feels a lot more spread out. Oh, Fisher Mall. That thing is huge. Wow. I was about to say everything's a little more spread out, and then suddenly something like that pops up. Massive. And another 24 hour Jollibee. Oh, cognac. Cognac's important, Rick. Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's a lot of these walkways to get across busy roads, but they stairs only. Yeah. So, no prams, wheelchairs. <laughs> Bring your fit bodies. Uh -huh. Don't hurt your knee. Uh, on our JCBs. I suppose if you've got a wheelchair or a pram, someone will probably help you across the road. Yeah. see that sort of thing everything's built into something <gasps> what is that Kenny Rogers Kenny Rogers Isn't he a country singer? I thought so he's like with Dolly Parton uh -huh. or something apparently he's got a, a roastery in the Philippines oh, see, he's famous for making roast stuff maybe it's American yeah maybe the pies were popping Maybe it's where you go to roast. Yeah. Can you roast? <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Popeye's 50th. Can you roast roast? Look at those big clouds. Yeah, they look quite ominous, but it's blue skies, which is quite nice. You gotta learn some new names. This is the jeepney. It's got Welcome RTD, Timog, and a few other places. Project 23. I assume that's where that one's going. And he has the hook. Cool bicycle. Ah, and then you can see the Burger King up ahead. We're not going there. This is Robinson Supermarket. Where, where? Did I miss it? Oh, behind us. There's a massive tower here. Maybe all your cell signal will be good here. Yeah, a lot of construction going on as well. Now, Kazon's the biggest city for something. Is it people or area? Area. Area. Biggest area. by area. Okay. Does feel a lot bigger out here. Oh man, look at this building. All these coloured uh, decal, I suppose. Quite a lot of Airbnbs here as well. Right. One of these. Okay, this is so M this Place. Is the, yeah, yeah, M Place. The beach. Oh, I did see something there. Oh, didn't we look at something uh -huh. here? Okay. That's 
dream thing. Yeah. So. But we weren't sure because their double bed looked like it only fits the yeah. pillow. <laughs> oh. Grab deliveries. It's still massive, wild, yeah. Well, what's nice out here is that the roads have big roads and then lots of pedestrian walkways on the side. Not like where we were, where you're half time walking on the road. Yeah. <laughs> Palm trees on the top of that building. It's still to be constructed. Looks like the metro up there. Okay. We are almost there. We're almost there. This is the last stretch. And still more construction going on. station so we've arrived guys hope you enjoyed that trip i'll see you after we get dropped off <laughs> oh wow that whole trip cost seven dollars from all the way over there to all the way over here Good morning, everyone thanks for watching see you again next time don't forget to subscribe <laughs>